COVID cases are on the rise this summer and health experts say the uptick is partly due to people staying inside trying to retreat from the heat looking for air conditioning. The illness is also mutating quickly. So what can you do to keep your family safe? Joining us with some of the insight into this, Dr. Caitlin Jettelina, an epidemiologist and data scientist. Dr. Jettelina, thank you so much for joining us here. Is there more to it? I mean, kids are going back to school. They're going to be in confined spaces. People are looking for the air conditioning in confined spaces. Is that leading to the uptick here? Yeah, we're seeing a lot of infections out there right now for COVID-19. And there's really three things driving this wave. One, like you mentioned, people are going indoors because it's hot. School is starting. Virus is spread very easily indoors. Two, the COVID continues to mutate very quickly, about two times faster than the flu. So this is why we're typically seeing this summer and winter wave with COVID. And then our protection is waning. Unfortunately, after your last infection, after your last vaccine, protection wanes over time. And so these three things are really driving this surge. A lot of infections out there. Unfortunately, this also means an increase in hospitalizations and deaths, particularly among the medically vulnerable as well. And the folks, uh, you know, they may be thinking, well, oh, it's it's late in the year to be worried about the COVID vaccine itself. It's it's too early maybe for the flu. Where do we stand on that? The, the two need to come together at some point, right? They do. And we're going to get two updated vaccines, one for COVID, one for flu for this fall. It should be coming out in the next couple weeks. And this is, we need these updated vaccines because these viruses, like I said, continue to mutate. They keep creating new versions of themselves. And our updated vaccines really address these mutations and make sure our immune defense walls are patched and really strong the next time we see this virus. Yeah, it's hard every year to try to calculate the flu virus, right? And, and get the, the right uh, vaccine for that. COVID mutating quickly, uh, maybe even more so. Are they safe and effectively updated to the point where uh, folks shouldn't be concerned about it? Get them both at once, just go do it? Yeah, these continue to be very safe. In fact, with COVID-19, these vaccines are under the most intense safety monitoring in U.S. history. There's hundreds of millions of people that have gotten the vaccine. And the story doesn't change. This, this vaccine is safe, um, same with the flu, and it's far more safer than getting infected. We are seeing that these vaccines provide additional protection every year too, about 60% additional protection against hospitalizations and deaths, particularly among those over 65. So yeah, it's, COVID is still around and we still need to remain vigilant and stay up to date with vaccines. All right, Dr. Caitlin Gentilino, bringing us up to date on where we stand with this. Can't believe we're still talking about it four years later or so, but uh, this is where we are. We thank you for the information. Appreciate it.